Hello and welcome to another edition of Tips for Dummies. Today I'm going to show you how to install a uh, three-way switch. This is going to be to turn off the light, uh, to turn on an outside lights of this building. So I got one switch right there and another it's going to be right in there. I'm not going to be talking about codes, uh, distances from uh, up to bottom or anything like that because this is just going to show you how to do a three-way switch specifically. All right, so I got this is one entrance or one exit, whatever you want to call it, and the other one is on that side. All right, so the first thing you got to do is to decide on which one you got the power, the juice, you know. So on this case, I have one connection right there. That one is gonna feed that switch. All right, so I'm gonna have to run a wire through there so that way I can feed that one and that will take it from there. All right, so I'm gonna start making the, uh, the holes. So I need to run the wire all the way over there. Like I say. I need to juice that thing. So, all right, so let me get it done. All right, so this is where the line is gonna go through. And it's gonna go down here for the switch. That's for the juice. Okay, so as you can see, I'm gonna run this wire through the holes. It's gonna be from this uh, box juice that is gonna go all the way to that switch. This is gonna be our power. This is gonna be the one fitting that switch right there, all right? So let me show you whenever it's ready. Okay guys, so I got the uh, wire, which is, this is gonna be the juice. All right, this is the power of this switch. And right here, oh, I got the bare wires, all right. So I got these three wires. This is gonna be uh, positive, common, and ground, all right? This is just a regular power switch. This is where the fun begins. Now, uh, the switch that we're gonna be using is a three-way switch, and it's just a little bit different than the other switches. And this has a common bolt in here that's what it makes it different from the other ones and I'm gonna get back to that in a little bit now the wire that we're gonna be using to transfer the electricity from this box to the other box is this one right here which it has four wires instead of three I'm going to show you right now. All right. This one has uh, the black, white, red, and the ground. Okay. I'm going to run this wire all the way from this switch to the other switch. And this is what you have to do if you want to uh, make a three way switch uh, run. You may find this type of switches like on stairs where you want one on top and the other switch at the bottom or in exits like this where you end you get entrance on one side and go outside for the other one and vice versa and you want to turn it on and off from that switch. All right, so let's get started. I'm going to run the wire from there to the other one. All right, guys. 
It's getting a little bit dark, but I already was able to run that wire from that side to this box. All right. <clears throat> so this cable, like as I mentioned it before, is the traveling current. It's gonna make it's gonna make a, the travel from this switch right here to the other side. All right. Now, so right here. Remember, I have the power source, this is the one that has three wires, and the traveling source. This one that has four wires. Now on that side, we're gonna add the cable that is gonna feed the source. Like on this case, it's gonna be a light that I'm gonna install right there to the outside and uh, that's the one that is going to feed it all right so I, I still got to add another cable from here all the way to, to over there so that way i can complete the wirings the wiring and we can start making the connections to the switch the three-way switch all right so i'm going to start installing the other uh the other wires for the source Okay guys, so I'm ready to uh, start the uh, connections. And the first thing I'm gonna do is then I'm gonna strip the, uh, the wires. It's the black wire from the power. from the power source and I'm gonna strip this I'm gonna call this a traveler strip this now as you can see you got four K4 four wires in here like I mentioned it to you power traveler I'm gonna strip the, uh, the wiring obviously while you're doing this I will already suppose that you check that you don't have any power, of course. So, um, strip this, all right. All right, so I got all the wires tripped in here, okay. So, now the first thing I am going to do is that I'm going to get the grounds together. This is the ground. Okay, so we've got the uh, ground together and obviously we're gonna connect it on the uh, ground itself, all right? I just wanna show you. Okay. So 
So, now that we have the ground wire, we're gonna connect the positive, the juice, the one that's gonna have power. All right, remember from the two, uh, two uh, three wire cable, we're gonna connect it to the black screw. You got one black screw. That's where the power is gonna go, right in here, all right? So this one it goes in here. Gotta make sure it goes there. Remember, black wire from the power, the power source is gonna go to the black screw. All right. Now we're gonna get the neutrals, the neutral from the power and the neutral from the traveler cable together. Okay. So we got the neutrals together. Now when putting a wire caps, uh, you don't have to twist it. The twist, it will be done by itself from the wire nut, right? All right. So we got the neutrals from the power source and the traveler switch together, all right? So now the only thing we got left is these two screws right here, which is the traveler wire from the traveler uh, wire. So we're gonna put the black wire from the traveler on one side and the red wire from the traveler on the other side. All right. Let's go ahead and do that. All right. Let's get it done. Okay. So I got the, uh, black cable from the traveler on one side and now I need to connect the red on the other side right in here if you able to see it I'm gonna make the loop I'm gonna connect Close it a little bit more and tighten it. All right. All right. So we got the circuit complete on this side. So let me show you. Ground on the black wire, on the black wire. I got the uh, black from the power source. On the other, I have the travelers. I got the black and the red on the other side. And we had completed our first switch. This switch is done and is ready to be put in in here. So now we have to go to the other switch, which by the way, it has to be the same as this one. It has to be a three-way switch. Otherwise, it will not work, okay? So 
let's get it done. So this is done, all right? I'm gonna put it inside. Now I'm gonna go to the other one. Let's do it. So, we jumped to the other switch. Once we got the uh, other all <laughs> wired up. And here it comes the most important part. This is the traveler. This is the one that it comes from the other side. It's got four wires. And this is gonna be the power, the one to, to power the, uh, the lights. So you need to make sure that uh, the black wire going to the power, the one that it has three switches, it connects to the black one. All right, next we're gonna get the uh, ground. <laughs> yeah, right. We're gonna get the ground. Put them together and tie it. How's the ground from both wires? So next. We're gonna get the two neutrals, the one from the traveler and the one from the power source, and we're gonna get it together. All right. Okay. We're gonna get the two neutrals. All right. So again. We got the black wire from the power source, the one that it has three wires on the black. We have the two neutrals. We have the ground. And now we got left with the black and the red, which we are gonna connect there on either side of the uh, switch. All right. the red on that and we're gonna connect the black on the other side this is uh, these wires is from the travelers the ones that it goes down there right So we got the whole circuit complete. The switch and that one over there. All right. I'm gonna put the switch back on its box and we're ready to rock and roll. So now we got this wire that is gonna hook up to the uh, light bulbs. And we're all done. Alright guys, so this is a summary of what uh, of what we done on how to wire a three-way switch. Alright? And this is like an enclosing you know close enclosed uh, proximity. So let's pretend this is the switch in which we're gonna put the uh, juice, the power which I'm gonna use this wire to pretend this is the the one having the uh, the juice, the one that uh, has the power. 
so usually it's uh, two wires and the ground okay so usually a regular uh, power switch in the house has two wires the black the white and the ground so we're gonna put it in the box let's pretend it's the box that you're gonna that you choose uh, to have the, the power all right so we stick it through there we're gonna use the left side just to um, it doesn't really matter but just to show you or uh, to show you how to do it I'm just gonna use the left side we're gonna pretend this is the one that it has the power two wires and the white now the traveler the one that it's gonna be trans transferring you know uh, transferring the uh, power from the uh, three-way switch to the other three-way switch is this wire which has three wires and the ground four wires total has white black and red three wires it makes sense isn't it a three-way switch three wires three ways you know so it makes sense this is the one that is going to be transferring the power to the other switch the other one is the one containing the power and this one is traveling all right so this i'm going to put it on the right all right so i got these cables right here all right so now we're going to continue on all right so we got uh all the wires in here and uh, this is the switch all right and the only difference between the normal switches and this one is one is that this one has this bolt usually black is the common bolt and then you got the travelers these two okay so the first thing you got to do before anything is connect all the grounds you might want to cut a little piece of ground so that way you can connect it to the switch on the ground so uh, we connect all the grounds okay now the, the, we got them all together we put the wire nut all right so we got all the grounds Here, and this is gonna go to the uh, ground on the switch all right so I'm gonna make a little loop right. and put them on the ground close it all right okay all right so of all the wires we already eliminated the ground so now we're gonna get the commons the common wires or the neutral I should say neutral wires we're gonna get them together is the neutral from the power switch and the neutral from the traveler switch the one that has three wires all right and we're gonna put them together. Right. So. Okay. So we got the neutrals and the ground. So now this is the important this is important right here. The black wire from the power from the switch that it has only two wires and the ground that black wire that one it's gonna go on the common of the switch all right you gotta make sure you do that for this thing to be able to work like the way it's supposed to be okay all right black wire from the power from the switch from the 
wire that it has uh, two wires and the, and the uh, ground. All right. So I'm uh, gonna make a loop. And I'm gonna connect it to the black bolt on the switch. All right. So, so far, we only have the ground and the black from the power source. Now, the other two remaining wires, which is a black and the red from the traveler, it's going to go on either side of the switch on the bottom. This is the one that is going to be traveling, is going to make the travel, uh, the uh, uh, tr the power to travel from one switch to the other one. All right, so let's connect the red one. And we're going to connect the black on that side. A loop and we're gonna connect it. Alright. Alright, so we got everything done. Black from the power uh, cable to the black. On the traveler we've got everything right here the traveler and the ground okay so this is done neutrals together grounds together we completed one part of the switch so now let's go to the other side of the switch and finish this up okay so now we're going we're gonna go to the other switch which obviously is the same type of switch for the other side. Now, the three wire, the other end from the traveler, the one that it has three wires and the ground, four total. Now we're gonna put them on the left, on the left side. All right. It's just a reminder, it doesn't matter what size it is, just I'm using it as a guidance. And the wire that is gonna feed the light bulb or whatever you're gonna be fitting you're gonna put them on the right okay all right all right okay so now we got the traveler cable and the power source So again, we're going to start with the grounds, with the ground wires, and uh, we're going to put this little piece of wire, alright, going to get them together. Okay, we got the grounds. and. Just like the other ones, we're gonna get the neutrals. The neutrals together. All right, we got the neutrals together. I wasn't able to get the ground properly. Okay, so now that we got the ground, the ground, and the neutrals together this is a very important step all right
you got to make sure that the black cable feeding the light it's going to be connected to the common or the black bolt on the switch got to make sure it's connected like that all right so we're going to connect it right here Having a little trouble. <laughs> uh, all right. So make sure the the black goes over there. And the black and the red from the traveler cable it's going to go on either side of the uh, switch. I made a mistake over here on the ground. This is not the ground. The ground is... We're going to connect this cable or the ground to the ground okay so the ground in It's going is going the ground is going to the green bolt and the wires the black and red from the traveler it goes to either side of the switch. Alright, connecting the red first. And the black wire goes on the other side. So the black wire from the traveler and the red wire from the traveler, it goes to either side on the bottom. And the black wire the one that is going to feed the light, it goes on the black. Neutrals together and grounds together. And, and this is it. It's done. The switch is done. A three-way switch. Okay? Alright. See you next time, guys.